Hi, these are the dog lick pads that um, that are advertised. Uh, they're six inches wide. And um, I've discovered after buying them, or after getting them, that um, they don't stick to my floor or my refrigerator and um, because they're textured. You need to put them on a smooth surface because there are these little um, pieces that are supposed to suction on. You can put them in the bathtub, you know, if they make a mess going over the edge, then it'll be easy to clean up in the bathtub. But I came up with a neat solution. I have a plate that is six and a half inches wide. It's a saucer that came with a thick mug, a big round mug. If I put this down inside of there and push, it's heavy enough to where my dog isn't going to bring it, you know, all over the house. Um, so, you know, if you think about putting it on a plate, find one that's made of ceramic that's heavy enough that it'll stick to. You see, the suction is really good. Listen to that. Okay? It's, it's not weak. It's very strong. So... And by the way, yes, yeah, of course you can put dog food or peanut butter in there. I'm sure everybody else has put pictures of that on there as in, you know, what they've done. So I thought I'd show you how well it sticks. So, yeah, definitely. It's a great product. You see these little bones in here? They're, uh, all the food will get smushed down in between those. And there's a nice edge here, too. It's the same height as the bones. Um. There you go. The red one is stuck to the countertop, too. If you want to put your dog on the counter, you're more than welcome.